After a year with the Air 75, I've upgraded to New Fi's Halo 96 keyboard. Join me as I share my two month ownership review of this Flexi product. The box includes a pre built keyboard, switch extraction tool, a color matching USB cable, a set of test switches, a 2.4 GHz wireless receiver, and a lot of extra keycaps. For an additional 29 US dollars, you can also add a matching wrist rest if you prefer a more comfortable typing experience. The first thing you notice when holding the keyboard outside the box is its weight. Coming in at approximately 1.5 kilos, this keyboard is designed to be exclusively used on a permanent desk. The keyboard's body is made up of plastic, frosted acrylic, and aluminum, which makes it heavy, but it also gives it a premium feel and durability. Apart from that, I also felt the keyboard to be a bit too tall for me since I was used to a low profile mechanical keyboard. However, the TAS wrist rest proved to be an ideal solution to support my ergonomic needs. Like with NewFi's other boards, this is also a visual stunning piece of hardware. The design feels very well thought out with minimal branding and NewFi specific features like the light strip at the top and the fun accent colored keycaps. The white color option that I have here adds a clean and classy aesthetic to the desk. However, it requires more work to clean than the black one. Thankfully, the keyboard's protective packaging can also serve as a dust cover when I'm away for an extended period. The keyboard is constructed with a combination of materials with frosted glass sandwiched between the aluminum housing for the top and the plastic at the bottom. This allows the RGB light to pass through the edge, giving that halo effect around the keyboard where it gets the name from. On the sides, you'll find a USB port and a couple of switches to toggle between the connection mode and the operating system. Additionally, NewFi has also included a magnetic housing for the 2.4 GHz wireless receiver. At the bottom, the keyboard offers two different raising angles, allowing you to adjust it to your preferred typing position. The Halo 96 keeps the promise of mechanical keyboards known for their customizability. The switches are hot swappable and you can choose from two switch lines, the Gatoron Pro 2s or the new collaboration between Gatoron and NewFi called the Baby Kangaroo or the Baby Raccoons. I have the Baby Raccoon switches on my keyboard and the keystrokes feel very smooth and it has consistent feel of a linear switch but with a snappier return. Since the keyboard comes with a damper kit by default, the sound is very comforting while you type. I might go as far to say that this has been one of my favorite aspects of the keyboard since it's so therapeutic for me to type on. The default keycaps have an excellent double shot PBT construction and rounded corners. They also have a subtle concave shape which helps to guide your fingers to the center of the key while typing. Since they also use a Cherry MX stems, you have many options for aftermarket keycaps. The redesigned spacebar to what NewFi calls Coast Bar is an interesting feature of the keyboard that sets it apart from others. It is essentially a specially designed spacebar that uses multiple layers of silicon to reduce sound and provide added stability. NewFi also sells shine through ABS keycaps for an additional 20 US dollars. They blend well with the keyboard and feel higher quality than the PBT ones, but they won't hold up as well to oil in your finger and wear because of the nature of the material. Talking about the size, adjusting to the 96% layout from the 75% layout took some time for me. If you're not keen to use the numpad, the smaller versions with a 65% or 75% layout might be a better option for you. NewFi always has an excellent lighting option on their keyboard. The RGB lighting on the Halo 96 is vibrant and adds a colorful touch to the overall look of the keyboard. The light strip at the top can act as a caps lock light, show battery status, and blink when function change. The north facing RGBs under the keys also have many different lighting patterns, colors, and intensity to suit your mood and preference. The Halo lighting on the edge is controllable independently via the key combinations or the NewFi console software although it is just exclusive to Windows users at the moment. The keyboard can connect to three devices over Bluetooth, which can be switched using the function and number keys at the top. It can also be connected directly via the USB-C cable or a 2.4 GHz wireless receiver for a low lag experience while gaming. The Bluetooth connection was also rock solid this time, with no noticeable lag or drops, all thanks to Bluetooth 5.0. Like with other keyboards, the USB cable can be used for wired operation or doubled as a charging cable. However, I strongly believe that it's high time for NewFi to provide USB-C on both ends 
in 2023. The battery life was also impressive, lasting me over 50 days with an average of 6 hours per day of use with the RGB lights turned off. For under 150 US dollars, the Halo 96 builds a strong foundation for mechanical keyboard that works flawlessly straight out of the box and leaves a room for customization. Its build quality, impressive battery life, and RGB lighting options makes it a standout choice for those looking for a mid-range, high-profile mechanical keyboard in 2023. Thank you so much for watching the video and also thanks to New5 for sending me the review unit for the keyboard. I've left a link to their product in the description box below. Until then, stay happy and healthy and see you in the next one.